this is monkey 1000. Oops, I'm trying to get the camera right. Okay, so today, the other day, a day or so, I got my Ipsy again. So here we got another one. This is February's, so we're going to open it up and see what it is. Okay, so let's see what we got. It's called Feel the Love. Will you be our Valentine? I'm not going to read the whole thing, but I'll let you read it. You can freeze it if you like. I do have a little glare going on here. Sorry about that. It's a little, little tiny dark. I got lots of lights on, but there you go. Hopefully you can see it. And here we go. All right. I'm going to bring you down a little bit more. There you go. So you can see better. Okay, so what you get is a ginger vitamin C fresh press sheet mask. Ooh, that kind of looks cool. It's a sheet mask. Cool. And they give you, you get three of these. So you get a beet and vitamin A fresh press sheet mask. And that's that one. There you go. There you can see it better like that. And then you get the sweet sweet chef kale and vitamin B fresh press sheet mask. Oh, that's kind of cool. Yeah, we'll have to try one of them out. And what else did I get? They didn't really give me a card. It just um, they usually give you a card saying which is which and all that, but I don't see one in this one. Uh uh. No. So they didn't give you one. So this is a nude illusion. Nude illusion. And it's pretty dark. So we'll try this on. It's a medium. Um, it's foundation if you didn't know. I mean, some women may not know. I don't know how all you guys are seeing this. Yeah, I might have to move. Maybe I'll move. I'll have to move because it's really, really dark. Okay, just hold on. Okay, I moved. Maybe you can see it a little bit better. It just seemed to be awful dark. So we're going to start over, okay? So I feel the love. That's a little message in there for you. You can read it. I'll let you all, and you can freeze it if you like. It's a Valentine thing from Ipsy. And they give you three masks, and one is kale, and one is beet and vitamin A, and this kale is a vitamin B. These are masks, and we have a ginger vitamin C sheet mask. So I got these look pretty interesting. Self-approved best for best beat of my heart. Oh, okay, that's what it says. Beat of my heart. Selfie approved. Don't kale my vibe. <laughs> and this one will say selfie approved. Oh, ginger snap. That's cute. So they didn't give me a list like they usually do. So um, we'll just pick and go. So this right here is the foundation. It's a medium. And we'll try this and see how well it comes on. Um, this is by Wander. I don't know. I have never heard of anybody like I have never heard of them, so I don't know. It looks pretty cool. And what we else we got? Oh, this is my eyeshadow. And they let me pick this one. They let you pick one, and then the rest they put in. So that's kind of cool. Let me see. Ooh, nice case. Got a nice little case. And you got your eyeshadow in there. Very nice. Ooh, I like that. I needed some new new stuff, so um, I thought, ooh, this would be a good chance to, to try some new stuff um, for eyeshadow. Okay, this one is uh, made in Germany. Ooh, okay. Let's open this up and see what it is. So this is, comes from Germany, this one. 
Cool. Oh, it's a, I believe it's an eyeliner. I believe that's what it is. An eyeliner. Yep, it's a thin one. Very thin. Very tippy. That'd be good for cat eyes. People who would like to do the cat eyes. Now I have a couple of these. Yeah. And they also give you... This is lip color. Okay. Yeah, this is lip color. And there's the box for that. We'll open this up and see what it is. How it looks. Ooh, wow. Fancy or what? That'd be nice to keep it for good when you go out in the evenings and stuff. Wow, cool. Very, very fancy. And that's the color. I'd say if it's like a, a light beige. Very, very pretty. Isn't that pretty? Wow. So cool. Very cool. I don't usually use lipstick much, but we'll try this and see how I like it. I like the little container. It's kind of cute. Fancy. And then, of course, for Valentine's Day, you get a pink little, little bag. That's cute. Every one of them, you get a bag. And, of course, it says Ipsy on each side here on the little thing for the zipper. Alrighty. Well, that's interesting. So, let's go and let's try some of this stuff. I think I'll try the makeup first and then maybe the mask after. Um, yeah. Because once you put the mask on, it seemed to get... The last one I did was very moist and it took a while for it to dry. So, we'll go into the bathroom and we'll be right back. Okay, everyone, we are in the bathroom, and we are going to try this one first. Ooh, I got a ball black. And we'll try the foundation first and see how well it works. Let me see here. Maybe open it. There we go. Got to break the seal. There we go. Oh, oh my. What the heck? Huh. Hmm. So, it doesn't really come out? Strange. I've never seen such a thing. Oh my gosh. Maybe we won't be trying this one out. It says, New Delusion Liquid Foundation. Well, the thing don't come out, so how do you do it? I don't know. Maybe it's not supposed to come out. Well, that's a little nuts. Hmm. I have no idea. And I can't read the back print. Look how small that back print is. So, do you squeeze it? Oh, see. Maybe you just squeeze it and use a, one of those sponges. I don't have one of them. So, I'll use a little bit of um, toilet paper here that I have, you know, just to, to spread it. So, maybe that's why it's like that. So, there, look. And you can just squeeze it on there. Eh, I have no idea. I think the thing's stuck. I, I wouldn't, maybe you fill up the cup? I don't think so. I don't know. See, I have no idea. See, you can't take it out. Ooh, it's stuck. Isn't that strange? So, we'll tear it this way. And of course, I didn't give you directions on this one. I don't know why. They usually do. So, that to me is a little frustrating. But, I'm going to show you in the mirror here so you can kind of watch me a little bit. And see how I do this. But, I just put a little bit on a paper, you know, piece of paper paper towel, whatever. And just going to dab it on. And I really don't need it because we live in Florida. And as you can tell, I've got quite a tan. 
it's from selling. We've been outside a lot and you know even when you don't um, you know get sun we always have the rays coming at us all the time so I really don't need this you know it kind of went you know maybe if I went out in the evening I might but let me see how all it looks yeah. Yeah. So. I did kind of all of it, so you know. Well, I really, you know, with the tan, it makes it harder to see it. I don't know if you can tell the difference or not. And I didn't do one side or the other like I did in the other one. I mean, it's pretty. It's okay. It's kind of darker than what I like. But, um, hard to tell when you got a tan, right? So, there you go. But that's a little strange. I'm going to have to play with that and figure it out a little bit more. Yeah. So, oof. it's really too dark for me. I don't like it. I really don't. But, I mean, what's the deal with this? Does anybody know how to use these? Ooh. Well, yeah. So, is that how you do it? Is put your sponge on there and then close it up? I don't know. So, if you know, Put a comment below, <laughs> show me, because it doesn't come out. So I'm thinking you use your sponge and and whatever, your brush, whatever you use, and do it that way. But it's, it's really too dark for me, I think. Yep. Oops. Got it on the floor. So anyways, let's try the lipstick. See how it goes. Love the container. Isn't that cute? And this is beige. Yep. So I'm going to put it on. It looks nice. I think it's pretty. I like it. Not bad. And I don't like lipstick. But theirs is nice. The other one I, I like too. So, looks very nice. I like that one. Fancy, fancy box. And let's do the eyeshadow. That's what I really wanted was the eyeshadow. So, See if I can find my brush. And I don't even know where I put the brush. I've been putting them in all these containers I'm getting. And I can't always find it. So let me see if it's in this one. Do I have a brush in here? Oh. So I got two of these now. And that's the problem. When you keep doing this and you get your samples, like I have this one, I have the beige one that I showed you all before, you know, you kind of forget what you got, you know? I mean, it's cool that, and it's fun to do this, but I guess if you had double of stuff, you know, you could always give one to your friend or, you know, give it for a gift or something like that to your girlfriend or something. I think that would be cool. Uh, let me see. All right. I will put you on pause because i got to find my eyeshadow brush. Be right back. Okay, I didn't find my brush. But, so, I'm just going to use a couple of these Q-tips. So, we can try it this way. Okay. Isn't that pretty? They're pretty colors. I really like it. So, we'll try a few of them. I'll do one eye a different color from the other eye. So, you can kind of see what I got. It'll take me a few minutes here, so you can watch me and see how well it does. Okay, let's do the 
I'm a pink girl, so we'll kind of just do the pink and show you how it works. That looks pretty. Yeah, hopefully you can see it. And then I'll take the other one, the lighter one, and put on it. And you got the two colors of pink in there. Now let's do, let's do blue. Now I don't wear blue much. I have blue eyes, but I don't ever wear blue eyeshadow. That's pretty. Maybe this isn't blue. This is like a purple. Oh, that's a purple. That's what that is. Okay, let's try it. kind of different. Uh-huh. And let's try um, I'll try the gray one maybe. There's a the gray one. So you can kind of see what it's like. And I'll just brush it in there. Kind of blend it all in. Best you can. Hmm. Let me see. Oh, my glasses get caught in my eyes. My head. Oh, not bad. Yeah, so you can kind of just blend it all in but nice. Take your time and blend it all in there. So that kind of, that's the purple and the gray. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> and let's see. We have the black, so we could kind of maybe outline it a little bit, maybe like here. Ooh. I don't know if I like that. I'm more of a pastel person. I'm not a dark colored really person. Even though I have a couple of pieces of my furniture are dark. But yeah. so that's kind of gives you an idea of what it is. Everybody knows how to put eyeshadow on pretty much. You put it on too heavy and too much. But I kind of just wanted to show you the colors. Let me see this one. See what this one does. Here, I'm going to wipe some of this off. So, then I can maybe, um, you know, show you. I'll blend it all in a little bit. Oh. Okay. Let me see how bad this looks. Or how good it looks, I should say. Take positive, right? Always positive. Yeah, not bad. Not bad. I like them. Yeah, they look nice, and they're light. They're not too bad. All right, let's try. Yeah, my glasses keep getting caught up in my hair. Sorry. Okay, so we'll try this brown one here. I'll put it over here a little bit. And the creases a little bit here. Kind of up it. So, let's see what that looks like. A little practice, practice, right, ladies? Yeah. It's bad. It's been a long time since I wear makeup. So, I wear very, very rare. So, anyways, that gives you an idea of what it looks like. Different colors. 
and you can combinate them, you know, the way you want. And your outfit. Depends what you're wearing, too. But it's got a nice little mirror, so you can kind of see your eyes through here. If you were out. So you could probably take this with you in your purse or something. So that would be very nice to go. And here we got this eyeliner. These things, I don't do very well with them. But we'll try to maybe do underneath and see how well they are. That is very pointy. Can you see that? Wow. Mm, I think these would do a nice line. Uh, I'm scared to do this, but here we go. So it makes it harder. Ooh, I feel it. It's on there. Ooh, no. Not for me. This liquid stuff never does well for me. Maybe if I practice it would. I really, really, I really don't like it. Ugh. It just doesn't do me anything. It's not very pretty. Not for me. I think you're supposed to take it and just dab and go straight line. Yeah. Well, if your hand jerks, this is not going to work for you. Because, see? That does not look good. And I don't like that. But see, when you have the pencil one, you have more control. So, with this, it's like... So if you're a jerky person, or you have bad hands, these things are just not going to work for you, I don't think. Anyways, that is it for that. And I'm going to take off my makeup that I have put on, that you can see. And we will have to charge your phone. Um, your phone. <laughs> whatever. Uh, charge the, the camera for a few minutes. I might have to plug it in and um, so we can finish the video. And what we'll do is one of these masks and we will see. I think I might try the beet one. That's the one I think I'd like to try is this one. So we'll be right back. Okay guys, I'm back. I took off my makeup and we're raring to go. Uh, like I said, I'm going to probably do this one. See how it works. We'll try this one. And let's see. B and vitamin A. Fresh pressed sheet mask. So you basically do the same thing as the other one. You keep it on for 15 to 20 minutes. And then you take it off. So we're going to put it on and see how well this goes. I will time it for 15 to 20 minutes. And let me see here. Make sure your hair is all back. You don't want it in, in the hair. And we'll try to do this one. Each one of these is a little different. I notice they give us quite a few of these in these bags. Which is okay, but you know, you get so many of them and you know, you want to try something different, you know. And these are different ones, so. Okay, we're straightening it up and trying not to rip it. Oh, look. It's got a little flower on it. Isn't that cute? Or whatever. Maybe it's a turnip for the heart. Sheet of my heart. Beat of my heart. That's what it says. Beats of my heart. So, I guess you put it on this way, and we're going to put this on. And, ooh, it's cold, really cold. Get it under the eyes, because I got puffy eyes. Oh, how cute. 
but not fancy. Hmm. Beat of my heart. That's so cute. Okay, so what I'm going to do is leave this on for 20 minutes and I'll be back. Okay everyone, now we are back. It's been 20 minutes, so I turned off the timer. And we are going to take this thing off. And then I was just looking at this pretty little thing right here. It is pretty, but I hope this doesn't become a tattoo on my face. I hope not. I think it's just a thing for the mask. I hope we'll find out. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to turn you a little bit, bring you in, oops, sorry, there we go, and you can watch me take it off, there we go, no, thank goodness, Woo! I was afraid that was going to be a tattoo, no, 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 I couldn't do that for work, but it is cute, be, be cute for a teenager or a kid or whatever, so that's it. We just take that off and throw it away. They're only one time use, so my face is cool. It is wet, so you just kind of let it dry and just leave it alone. That's what you do. So that's it for now. Monkey's going to say she's out. I hope you enjoyed my video. Uh, if you did, hit the like button and subscribe please and also the bell so you can see some more great great videos that was alexa she's talking again on her own now she heard me so she's having trouble understanding so anyway <laughs> that's it for now so um stay tuned for more great videos we'll be back Monkey says she's out for now. Bye, y'all.